make for the tower's egress, of course. Oh, and do mind the tower's guardians, they tend to be unwelcoming. Hello, welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy Tactics A2. This is Drake Lord 56 the hero you're better off without. We are smack dab in the middle of Bright Moon Tour, and we're still chugging along quite well. Got quite a bit of a fight here. Not that it's really not going to amount to much considering our level, but they are going to cause us quite a bit of trouble if we do not take care of them. Especially when they do that kind of damage. And when they also suck your life dry as well! My god! <laughs> yeah, we're gonna have to take care of each and every one of these assholes as well. Otherwise, we're gonna be pretty much dead by the time we can get to that moonstone. And stop that! Alright, let's start breaking shit. You're pissing me off already! All right, let's see here. Sneak attack. That's more like it. We'll quite kill it, but oh, oh, cool! I killed it. <laughs> All right, <laughs> you just set the bar there, Pola, and you don't even have the crimson tear on yet. <laughs> I think she earned it. So I think by the next episode I should actually equip that thing to her because she kicks ass! Why not give her the ability to do so much more? Alright, let's take care of this guy here because he could take half of our of health in one shot thankfully that prevents him from doing just that and so will this almost almost Killfith, why don't you finish him off? We'll take care of that little dragon later on. Love Drain. No room for error. Whatever the projected damage is, is absolute. That can't be good. Oh, that can't be good. Or... Okay, he was slow to begin with. What did that exactly accomplish? Let's just... Yeah, not quite kill him, but... Yeah, not too bad at all. It's just the guy's almost dead. So why did you finish him off, Larea? There we are. Now let's take on the rest of these guys. All right, see your cross counter. Nope, that won't do. Blur is uh, just dodges bullets. Pummel to do quite a bit of damage to him, and I think maybe a Sidewinder might finish him off. So let's use a Shimmering Blade on that guy. And 
Yeah. Let's have Tracy finish off the dragon. She should be able to, by all accounts. Way to go, Tracy! Uh, let's take care of this guy. And, uh... You're tit for tap! Alright, let's make our way up to that uh, moose zone, and I th think at that point we will be at the, at the top of this portion of the... of the Bright Moon Tour. It, interestingly, when we enter the uh, Bright Moon Tour the second time, from a different location, of course, we'll be much further up the tower than where we will leave off. I'm guessing those other uh, poor, or guessing those uh, other entrances are just shortcuts to higher levels. Who knows? Zeno's the last up to. Oh no, it's not Zeno, it's. Killeth. <laughs> I didn't see Killeth on screen. <laughs> oh, poor guy. He's just barely limping up the stairs. Well, with the movement score he has, at least. guys are getting all sorts of levels. <laughs> yep, here it is! The first watch of the Bright Moon Tour! Now, it may look like we outnumber these guys, but... There is quite a surprise in store for us. Well, that guy's not a good... is not a good example. It comes more from the two Marlboro Kings. Or the Nemesis, that's what it is. So... Yeah, these guys are level 90! We are just- we're only in the middle of 60. If, well, as an average, at least. So we've got quite a fight ahead of us. Thankfully, these Mobros will they probably just be healers. But that'll- that is- what makes them really bad, because they're going to be casting region on everybody when they get the chance. So we're going to have to get rid of the Zamaba as well, because he can do some pretty nasty stuff to us as well. That's not a really good example either. Hurt yet? Why are you? Oh, you my further buffs. Uh, these guys are friggin' annoying as hell, and they're still not done with their turns. 
Sure! Pollock gets the turn right in the middle of it, but they get even more! And of course, the frickin' rabbit has a has an a, a tackle enemies attack. Oh, oh, oh shit! Yeah, yeah, yeah. That that's bad. Six fucking HP left. I yeah. Uh, Okay, let's see what she can do here. But I'm hesitant. I'm hesitant. No! No, no! Way too low damage, and he's gonna kill her immediately. So, Paula, you're probably gonna have to sit there. Uh, although I... Th How about the whirlwind on that Marlboro? I don't know, that's the best thing I can think of. Best thing to do is have Pola just sit this part out until I can get her health back. Holy shit! Uh, at least these guys are get uh, losing their buffs already. They're not doing their breath attacks for some reason. They're doing regular attacks, which are just as devastating! Especially against freaking mages! And you're reapplying haste? Asshole! Are you goddamn serious? All right. What? Let's just cast double cure on Pola. She desperately fucking needs it. This is gonna be one of these fights. All right. I don't know. Oh, so your uh, Bex, uh, I don't know, use a, a cross counter on that Umbaba? Oh, that'll do much! Ha ha ha! Yes! 338! Uh. Of course, he gets half of that back! Alright, how about an Aura Blast? Won't do as much as those freaking buffs. Alright, I think a Sidewinder could do some decent damage. Good enough! Alright, Kalatheth! You know what to do! Fish that guy off before he does anything more horrible! Like, almost kill Pola again! Ah, oh, come on! Oh, that's right, the guy has mirror mail on! I totally forgot about that! More goddamn healing?! Son of a bitch! And that rabbit's gotta freaking die! Alright, uh... I think a sneak attack will take this guy out now! Because holy shit, I do not want to deal with him anymore! 
This is gonna have to do. Awesome! Dude's gone! Alright. Their main method of damage is gone. Things should be a less like. trudging through a, a swamp now. I don't know, that was the first thing I could think of. Alright, cool, we got a confused Marlboro. Hopefully, that'll actually help out. Hopefully. Little bit of healer. Thank you very much. Alright, what are you gonna do, Mr. Rabbit? Seriously? Regular attack? Well, it does bring your HP down to critical. So what are we gonna have to do? It's, uh, our next target is that freaking rabbit! That's not gonna help! Well, at least you're talk attacking the wrong person. So... Can we do a double cast of fire over there? And if so, can we get both of them hit him? 65% chance of hitting both. Let's do fire whip. That less chance of actually hitting our our friends. And let's hope that both of these hit, because we that way our lives can be that much easier. Awesome! Okay! Okay! i things are looking better now. Alright. I think a good old pumble will take this asshole out. The second attack was the one that took it down! Hell yes! And without the freaking rabbit and the uh, Hamaba, these guys stand a little to no chance. If only Confuse would work for us at some point! Okay, I want to take care of the non-confused Marlboro. The freaking protect and the defense increase is not really helping matters. But damage is damage. But I'm su I suppose he's gonna heal it right back, is he? No, no, he's gonna try to debuff kill Seth. Thank God he decided not to do any other thing. So let's see here. That'll do. That'll do. Alright, let's gang up on this guy. Let's see here, uh... If nothing else, we get it slow. Hmm, we don't even get it slow. Oh well. Let's finish him off with, with a, uh... I think, uh... Yes, yeah, heal up Pola first. She needs a just in case they, des <laughs> they decided to attack her and get lucky. All right. All right, kill this. Hey. I think the next attack will uh, will show them what you can do. Especially since they're friggin' healing. Friggin' 
asshole Marlboros. Well, at least the Protect is gone. We could do a little bit more damage. Wow. <laughs> the, the Protect does a lot to uh, decrease damage, but... Oh my god! Stop singing at your... You guys are horrible singers anyway! Alright, that's it. Don Daga! Fry you friggin' assholes! Alright! I think a sneak attack will take care of one of them. And a good old pummeling will take care of the other. Oh. That fight was exhausting! Ugh. Even this won't kill it. We're probably gonna have to double cast, I think, a uh, blinding wind. A shiny air. That's what it is. Shining air. That seems to be the best choice at this point. The guy doesn't even have a shell, so we're pretty much golden here. Won't kill him. But I'll bring him pretty low. I'm just glad that we uh, took care of the rest of these guys. Hope you enjoyed singing. I th that was your last number. It's time for your favorite little psychopath to take you out. Hmm. Physical problem. Hmm. I think, uh... Yeah, that'll do. Finish it off! Exactly what we needed! Well done, Polo! Well done! And that was the first portion of the Bright Moon Tour! And I think that'll do it for this episode as well! So if you like this one, hit the like button, comment on it, and if you want, subscribe. So until next time, see you later!